Hyundai has expanded the N-Line range so much that almost every single model in its lineup gets an angrier looking alter ego. The latest to join the trend is the Hyundai La Festa, a China-only sedan, slotting right in between the Elantra and the Sonata. The highlight of the new La Festa in line is of course the new, more aggressive body kit and prominent aero features, making it look like a full-blown Hyundai in model. The La Festa in line sports a new grille with hexagon-shaped LED drills and glossy black trim, connecting it with the aggressive headlights. It also gets significantly larger bumper intakes, an aluminum style insert, a splitter that expands to the sides, and a faux intake on the base of the bonnet. In addition, there's a set of two-tone alloy wheels with the end badge on the center caps, leaving the red brake calipers visible behind them. The model also gets side sill extensions, a new rear bumper with full outlets, a large decorative diffuser with quad exhaust pipes, plus a rather flamboyant rear wing mounted on the tailgate. The interior looks quite modern, featuring a digital cockpit with two 10.25-inch screens and a set of physical controls underneath, plus a redesigned center tunnel with a wireless charging pad and buttons instead of a traditional shifter. Those changes might be carried over to the rest of the La Festa range in the near future as part of a mid-life cycle update. Details that will most likely remain exclusive to the inline or the end badge on the flat bottom steering wheel, the red stitching on the seats, and the sport driving mode. Under the hood, the latest member of the inline range does not share its engine with the rest of the La Festa range. Instead, it introduces a new turbocharged 1.5-liter four-cylinder producing 197 HP. Interestingly, the new engine is slightly less powerful than the older turbocharged 1.6-liter, which produces 201 HP, that is found under the bonnet of the lesser La Festa Luxury Sport.